It's a nationally ranked unbeaten team against the squad that's in search of its first win of the season. Thanks for tuning in with us here as we get ready for game day in the American Digital Network studio. Recent history has shown ECU is capable of beating anyone at its home stadium, and the Pirates are hoping to take down Virginia Tech Saturday for win number one. ECU has made a habit of scoring wins against ACC teams at Dowdy Ficklin Stadium. The Pirates knocked off NC State last year, took out Virginia Tech in 2015, and rolled past North Carolina in Greenville in 2014. If a win in 2017 is to follow, the Pirates will have to shake off a pair of sluggish performances to start the season. Head coach Scotty Montgomery has shaken up his defensive staff this week, hoping that a more aggressive approach will pay off for the Pirates. ECU has allowed an average of 616 yards and 45 points to a pair of quality teams, and those numbers simply have to get better to support an offense that has proven to have some playmakers. The Pirates are expected to stay with Thomas Sirk at quarterback. Sirk, who led Duke to a four-overtime win against Virginia Tech in 2015, moved into the starting lineup last week as Coach Montgomery looks for stability at that position. Montgomery has promised to make more of an effort to get his playmakers the ball, which bodes well for wideouts Davon Grayson and Jimmy Williams, who are both capable of big plays. On the other sideline, American Athletic Conference fans will see a familiar face as former Memphis coach Justin Fuente leads the Hokies. Virginia Tech has gone 4-1 in road games under Fuente, who has Virginia Tech ranked number 16 nationally coming in. The Hokies are 2-0 following wins against West Virginia and Delaware. You can catch Saturday's game at 3.30 p.m. Eastern Time on CBS Sports Network with highlights to follow right here on the American Digital Network.